Hello world. And I see something out my window, or out my door, that scares me a little bit. Oh, it's gone. Never mind, I don't see it anymore. It's still there, though. Um, there, you see that? See that? Skeleton horsey. Um, this is a trap. This is going to pop the four horsemen of the apocalypse as soon as I get too close. But I think I need to do it. Um, I don't know if there are any creepers back here. But, let's try it. Oop, there's a creeper. Ooh, there's a lot of creepers. There's an ender person. Hi, ender person. Alright, we need to get rid of the creepers without getting rid of the horse. Hey, come in a line. Do do. Doing the Congo. Creeper Congo. Well, that took care of them. That. Where there's two creepers over there. Hi. Hi, come on. Ooh. Come this way. You did not take out my beach. Mmm, creepers. Yep, and they destroyed some of my sand tomb. So, here's the deal. Can we pop this thing? I better eat something. Get up the ladder before the skeletons shoot me to death. Life is full adv of adventure. Some of it terrifying. Hi. Oh, there's two of them. Did did they already pop? There's another one over there. What the heck? Let's get close, see what happens. Wow, look at this. Somehow, I don't... Oh, there's another creeper. Where'd the creeper go? There it is. Hmm. That is very interesting. Creeper, creeper, creeper. Oh, hi. <laughs> Don't go down there, horse. Oh, there, here it comes. So, how come they're... How come the skeleton horses are like that? Um, you've got to be kidding me. Why are you getting stuck in these spots? Ah! So, um, let's move some sand around. Maybe we can fix this up a little bit. Yeah, so why are the skeleton horses like that? I don't understand. I think I would have needed to be close enough for them to, um, the trap to happen. Where? Where? Put it there. But apparently, I don't. Or maybe they did it because I was close enough inside. Interesting. So anyway, I've got some skeleton horses. And now, now I have something to do with all those saddles I've been saving. Hmm. Okay. Next thing. Let's see if we can get this Enderman. Because you know it's all outworn. There it is. All outworn Ender per persons. They started the war, but we're going to finish it. Okay, so we're here. Where'd it go? Got it? Haha. <laughs> Give me your ender pearl. Which I think is their heart. Whenever it is their heart. But maybe they don't have hearts. Maybe it's their brain. There we go. Look at that. Alright. Now that we have the morning adventure out of the way, the question is what do we do today? And I've got two ideas. Um, number one, we started, oh, and, and notice I'm wearing, I'm not wearing my, my, my mom, or sorry, mom's t-shirt, and that's because it's getting a little bit damaged, and I wanted to save it and, uh, repair it with some leather. Um, but also note, 
my chests are getting full here. That one's not quite full, but then I'm, I'm saving that. But look at all these books. I have to do something with these. Yeah. Um. I'm hearing a spider now. Maybe I'm not done with the adventure for the morning. Let's check around here. No, oh, it looks like we're done. It looks like we're done. And we lost one of our fence posts there, too. Creepers. Oh! 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 I'm so mad I can't push buttons. Oh! Okay. Um, let's put this stuff away. Okay, so what was I thinking? Oh yeah, there's two things I want to do today. Number one, um, we started the the nether portal network. We could continue with that because off camera I did some um, obsidian mining. Um, number two, I could build a second platform for the uh, sp mob spawner thing. And number three, I could move this platform down a little bit. So, um, let me get over here and adjust my inventory and I'll be right back. Okay everyone, I'm back and uh, I haven't quite adjusted my inventory yet, but... I wanted to show you how much that's not obsidian. Obsidian I have. I have over almost you know over four stacks, but close to five stacks of obsidian. That was a long grind. Nothing exciting happened, so you didn't miss much. There were no there are no creeper explosions. There are no baby zombies. There's nothing like that. Um, so I've decided that what I'm going to do is do the overland portion or the overworld portion of the portals I've already set up. So I still have the coordinates. Um, I'm going to go run and put them to put these portals in place and see if I have the right idea about what's going on. Uh, but first though, I'm going to go to bed. Because I've been fishing and I don't want any phantoms out while I'm in a boat. Okay. So now there's our boat. Zipped over here. Ah, there's our boat. So let's for our boat. All right, um, so I'm going to try and do a time lapse. I'm going to go to the first four items that match with the portals that we did down below. And I'll, so have fun and enjoy listening to the music. See you in a bit. Okay, everyone. Hel hello. Um, I'm framed like I'm a beautiful picture. Here's our first one. Oh, let me get the dirt back. So I'll need that later. Did I get that one back? Nope. Oh. All right. Now here's the the proof of the concept. D oh. Does this line up? Um, in theory, this one should have been at negative eight oh eight and negative three ninety two. So, let's see, but notice I, I put it negative 816, because negative 808 would have been out over the water here, and I didn't want to do that quite yet. So, I'll have to, oh, I can't get back up there now. So, I'll have to adjust this one in the nether by one as well. I, oh, hi, hi, hi. But, I think that's doable. Um, but, let's see if this lines up with something. Where does this one take me? Takes me here. And which one is here? I think this is the one we wanted. Let's check our coordinates. 101, negative 50. Uh, that's just about perfect. Um, except for the adjustment we have to make to put it in the right spot. Now, where does this one take us? Ah, ha ha. Ha ha, ha ha, ha ha, ha ha, yes. Okay, so um, I'm gonna continue on with this and I'll see you in just a little bit.
Hi. Portal number two. Where did this one take us? This one looks... This looks mostly correct. Um... Maybe not. Nope, this is not correct. I... Well, I don't know. Let's look at this. I think this one should have been down there. Huh. I don't know. Uh, let's check our coordinates. That'd be the best way to do this, right? So... No, this one is not correct. This should this is our fourth one. So why did it take us here? Portals don't make any sense. They don't make any sense. I don't know why this one put me here. Unless it's that funny Y coordinate thing that kind of screwed me up here. Cause I that should have been that one right there. Hmm. Well, I'd, I don't know what to do except keep placing them and see what happens. Uh, yeah, let's let's get out of here. Ooh. Yeah, see that second portal, the one behind me on my left shoulder, my left shoulder, your right to the screen, should have been on that island, I believe. So what is going on? Why is it doing this to me? Why are these portals uh, failing to to live up to my will to... Uh, I don't know what I'm trying to say. So, next one. Negative 960. Hold on. Two, nope, that way. This way. Right here. And then, negative 488. Which is over here in the water. So I'm not going to go in the water. So then I need um, 496. Negative 496. And maybe this is why, because I'm adjusting all these slightly as I do them. So, maybe that's it. But I think this one was oriented this way, compared to the other two. Let's do them like this. Let me get out of here. Yeah, portals confuse me. I don't know why they don't line up sometimes. Um, if any of you have an idea, please let me know. Um, I, like I said, even Jimmy doesn't understand these things. I would, the coordinates are almost right on this, that, on the X, y, X, Z coordinates. Uh, those were almost correct. Almost correct. And it was by far the closest one on X, Z coordinates, so it must be the Y that's screwing us up somehow. Um, yeah, I don't know. I just don't know. Maybe I have to break them and send them back or do something. I, I would think it would, they would just line up, but what do I know? So this one should take us probably to the same one. Uh, maybe they all end up at that same portal now. Nope, this one sends me here. That is so strange. Because that one... That one is closer on the X to the second one. And this... So this is the third one, so that actually worked. Huh. Yeah, I don't, I don't understand it. I don't understand it. Well, how do we get that one to work? Hmm. Oh, well, one more to do. Oh, it's bedtime. Hold on. One more to do. I think that one was right over here. See, and this one should have been our fourth one. This should have ended up on that patio with a, a plateau where the gas took us out and we took out the gas. That was... I have to say that was a magic moment, taking out that gas. I don't, I've never done that before. I've never done that before. You know, like I said, I've always been on peaceful mode. I like, for some reason, this, this episode, I seem to be giving a lot of uh, chest shots. These are sort of busts. You've got my head and my chest, but no hands. So, um, let's see our coordinates here. We need negative 10, or 64, which is over this way. 1064 is right here. And then we need negative... Um, 512, which I think is going to be this way. Right, oh, no, right here. Right there. And, see how this one goes for us. I'm missing, oh yeah, I left some dirt in the nether one. Should have taken that dirt while I was up there.
All right, this should put us back on the gas platform, or plateau, gas plateau. And here we are, gas plateau, right? This is it, that worked. So for some reason though, the second one didn't line up. All the others worked out just fine, so I wonder why that is. Now where's this one gonna take us? Will it take us back to the second island or will it take us to the fourth island? Fourth island. Why didn't the second one work? That is so strange to me, so strange. I don't understand it. Um, if you can explain it, please uh, point me to something that will explain it to me. But, I'm going to head back to our home islands, and I'll be right back. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm going to head back to our home islands. I'll be right back. Where am I going? What am I doing? Hold on. Watch this, watch this. Watch this. Huh? 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 Oh. Where am I? What am I doing? Whew. Oh, hi. That was a... Uh, don't do that in the wrong perspective. That was terrifying. Alright, well, look at this. How do I get down now? Am I going to have to jump? Oh! Ouch. 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 Let's take our portal network. Now where... We have a tunnel here. Where's our tunnel? Right? I made a tunnel, right? Oh, there it is. Oop, that's not it. Look at this. I'm going back to our home island. Look at all the pig people are coming back. Hi. Hi. And we're back. Oh, and Louis lost more fences than I thought. I'll go through the gate anyway. Hi, horse. All right, so that was a little adventure. Nothing much happened except for I got really confused about portals. Um, I'm gonna get ready for the next event and we'll talk to you in just a moment. Hello, everyone. Uh, Jarender, back. I'm back, Jarender's back. And uh, the moon is coming up, the sun is going down. We're uh, standing on the big uh, uh, dirt scaffolding near the platform. Um, let's check to see if we've, we've, we've got some stuff in here. This is, this is, this is okay. Um, so the first thing I need to do is actually move this platform. I don't want to add a second um, spawning platform yet because it'll be too low and the mobs won't die when they hit this platform when they fall from there. So we need to move this down first. The question is how far do we move it down? And I've already built a little dirt platform up here to give me a little working space. Let me show you this quick. Oh, and they're already starting to spawn, which is good for them, but uh, better for us. Um, so what I need, the second platform has to be leave two block gap between the lip and the platform itself. And so what I did was put three dirt blocks there. Ooh, there goes a witch. Do, I wonder if we get it. Oh, it didn't die. And the witch didn't die. Why didn't the witch die? So clearly, clearly something else has to happen here. Good thing we're moving that platform. Can I sleep here? Nope. Yep, I can. Good. Anyway, where was I? So this will be the spawning platform right here, so that way they can walk too. It also has to be within 32 blocks of the AFK platform, and I checked it out, and this is actually 31 blocks away from the, the spawning platform. So it actually is just within. Um, so what I may end up doing is moving it down to one. Just, just for aesthetic reasons or personal reasons. So I may do it one more. So that means I need to get up here without dying. Oop, that's maybe one too high. Maybe one too high. I think I just said that. Like there. So I think that's the level that this the spawning platform needs to be on. Let's throw a torch up here. Um, but first we have to move the platform. And first we have to take care of that witch. 
I wonder if I can get that witch with the... Oh, look at this. I've got a pokey thrower and I've got some pokies. There it goes. Into the water. Good. Ah, yeah, well. So, I'm going to try and take care of this witch. This may be a lot of fun, or it may be a lot of not fun. We'll see what happens. Hi everyone, I'm Jarander here, and just realized that I'm actually quite sleepy, so I think I'm going to save this project for another time. Um, you saw me take care of the witch. Um, I want to verify my math as well. I just want to make sure that everything is lined up properly. I'd hate to build all this and then have it be one block too low. Um, I also need to figure out how far that spl down that splat form actually has to go, because obviously you saw the witch live, and I don't know why the witch lived. It should have... I don't think they can wear feather falling. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. So, um, thank you for watching, everyone, and we'll see you next time um, on Jaren. Oh, yes, and like if you like, and uh, subscribe if you like, and comment down below if you have a solution for those those portals. If you understand why the witch didn't die, please let me know down in the comments. And uh, we'll see you next time on Jaren Orlandia. Goodbye.